Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. He's known for his role as Todd in Tyler Perry's TV series, For Better or For Worse, and as Professor Haygood in BET's breakout series, American Soul. With several solid roles under his belt, he's continuing his run as a working actor in Hollywood, starring in the new film, His, Hers, and The Truth. Take a look. If you go out and cheat on me while I'm out cheating on you, it's over. That's the ultimate disrespect. Well, that's such a double standard. How is that a double standard? It's in the Bible. Guys, oh, please mercy. welcome Brad James. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I go out and cheat on you. Brad, cheat on me. Brad, Brad, we got a lot to talk about. Yeah, we got a lot to talk now. about this come movie. Come on, come on. Hello, hello. How are you, sir? Now. How you doing, honey? Come Good on morning. in, everyone. Oh, I tell you, black don't crack, but the show does sizzle. Oh, <laughs> that's cute or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> so, How you doing? You doing all right? I'm great. Good, yeah. good. It's always good to have you back down to the circle, uh, especially when you have new projects. But let's talk about you a little bit more. You are not afraid to stretch yourself when it comes to choosing versatile roles. Is this something that was kind of forced upon you or something that you always went out to do? You know, absolutely. This, this is the kind of thing where when you get in this business, mm -hmm. you do it because you choose to. You mm -hmm. do it because you love it. You know, a lot of people that have studied my background know that I came from the Marine Corps. Yeah. I came from, you know, that small town upbringing. My mm -hmm. grandparents are pastors. So um, I came into this career field because you could do anything. You could be anything. Yeah. So of course I want to stretch myself. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. You know, they said, do you want to be a doctor, a lawyer, an assassin? I said, all of it. So I became an actor. <laughs> right, right, right. Mm -hmm. That's right. Good. It makes sense like to that. me. Right, right. It does, good. absolutely. Good. But what doesn't make sense to me is the last so the clip we saw. Mm -hmm. It did not make sense at all. It's okay for the man <laughs> to go out and cheat, but if you cheat on me while I'm cheating on you, we got a problem. Yeah, yeah. I, th I think everybody knows that. <gasps> yes. Oh my God, yeah, that's a standard in rule. my spirit, <laughs> Brad, yeah. I'm telling you. Now, I, I gotta put it out there before you say this now. That is a character. Uh -huh. Now, I blame the director and writer, Coke Daniels, uh -huh. for that particular line. Okay, so if one. anybody thinks that is um, that, that Alan character from His, Hers, and uh -huh. the Truth is me, because he's kind of a jerk throughout uh -huh. the film, yeah. which is a lot I of think fun you like playing this role. You, you, you better bounce back. You better bounce <laughs> no. back. But let's talk a little bit about Blind Dates, because we know in the, in, the, in the show, in the series, it talks a little bit about two college students meeting on a blind date. Mm -hmm. Have you ever went on a blind date? Have I ever, I feel like if you don't know the person ahead of time, every date is kind of a blind date because mm. all you know is what you've heard about the person, uh -huh. right? Or the representative that they are bringing to the table. How about right, that? yeah, yeah, yeah. I've, I've, I've dated people that months later turned out they were <laughs> blind dates. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> no. What's been your worst blind date? Oh God, you really gonna ask me I that am. right here? why not? On live TV. Yeah, yeah. Circle, this is what's what's we my, do. Um, um, I haven't had any really terrible experiences as far as dating. I've, I've been um, very fortunate mm -hmm. to come across amazing women throughout the course of my life who I have nothing but good things to say about. Okay, good, yeah. good, good. Will they say the same about you? Just playing, I was just playing. But you're still not married, but that's not my business. Oh. That's not my business. Ooh. That's not my business. We're on it today. Mm. Okay, mm. so uh, about this film, what truly resonates with you about this particular film? Um, the fact that it's told from more than one point of view. Mm -hmm. It's called yeah. His, Hers, and the Truth yeah. um, for a reason. Yeah. And it's because there's different sides to every love story, yeah. especially a great love story. So, you know, this has been one of my most fun things filming. We had a great time on set. We had yeah. a phenomenal mm -hmm. cast. Yeah. I, like I tell you, um, Coke Daniels was the writer, director, but, you know, we had Coco Brown, who, you know, oh, I did yes, yes. I did, yes. Coco. I did seven years on For Better or Worse with Coco, and she's amazing. Thank I you. can't wait to work with her Thank as always. Yeah. Um, uh, we had some amazing special guests. And, um, we had Dorian Wilson mm -hmm. on the cast, um, Ashley A. Williams, who was a phenomenal uh, lead actress in it. We just had a lot of fun. Good. Dwayne Finley, like it was a great time. Um, I don't know that people have seen me in a role quite mm -hmm. like this before because I've done comedy yeah. and I'm doing action next. But to do something in between where it's like, yeah, it's funny parts, but it's some very real, yeah. romantic, yeah. but serious relationship moments that happen in this movie. Yeah, yeah. awesome. Good I stuff. gotta see that. I gotta yeah. see it. But let's talk a little bit about your new project or your latest project on mm -hmm. BET, the BET ser series, mm -hmm. uh, American Soul. Yeah. Uh, what, how did you stretch yourself for this role or what would you say you improved on? with taking this role. So with American Soul, the, the thing that that happens with it is that it's a historical 
piece of work, mm -hmm. right? So you have to cover a piece of history. So mm -hmm. what you want to do is listen to the music from the era. Yeah. And for those of us who kind of grew up on Soul Train, we know what it is, and it was fun. Yes. So, you know, I had the big afro and yeah. the, uh, um, the, the, the porn star stash. Oh, my God. Um, <laughs> <laughs> no, it was, a, it was a great time. Yeah. Um, and and, and I, I got to say this about Robbie Reed and the rest of BET for the casting of that. Yeah. They did a really, really great mm -hmm. job. The young talent that they brought yeah. in, they were doing their own singing. Well, Robbie is legendary. She's amazing. Yeah, She's amazing. yeah. absolutely. Yeah. You know, as creatives, we try to find the sweet spot. We're always mm -hmm. trying to find, like, what is our thing? What is our thing? Do you feel like you're in your sweet spot, or is there more? I, to I, come? I, I, I do right now. Okay. You know, I've been in this business for a minute. You know, you guys have, have known me for mm -hmm. a, a, a while, coming coming through this and and going from sitcom to TV to film, and web series, web series. <laughs> yes. You know, the whole gamut, but. Where I'm coming into now is yeah. the producing side, where you're starting to create That's the things good. that you do. I'm a producer on His, Hers, and the Truth. I'll be a producer on my next projects coming up. And that's the kind of thing that, when, when you start feeling your sweet spot, it's like where you want to make a change, yeah. where you want to kind of adjust Shift. the things that are going, yeah, yeah, yeah and yeah. teach and yeah. educate. Yeah. Yeah. I love that. That's I, good. I want to see you in that capacity. Yeah, that's yeah. awesome. What, what else do you have on the horizon? What's, what's coming up? Um, I, I have a slate of new series that are coming up. I, I have one for Amazon. Ooh, good. Um, yeah, it's yes. called The House Divided. It's Ooh. got a phenomenal cast. I don't have a release date for it yet, but we're definitely um, coming very soon, so stay tuned to Amazon yes. for House you Divided. Are Here's yeah. you, you are the epitome of a working actor. I told him oh, that yes. he had lots of jobs. <laughs> yes. I told him that at the beginning. Absolutely, but thank you so much, Brad. It's mm -hmm. always good to see you, and be on the lookout for the official release of His, Hers, and The Truth. And the conversations continue on social, on all social media platforms at Sister Circle TV. Thank you, Brad. James, you're always awesome.